Learning inequities are one of the biggest setbacks a child can face outside of the classroom, especially in the summer months. The Andy Roddick Foundation is working to expand opportunities for young people to learn, succeed and thrive later in life. Here's how they're helping move the needle forward toward more equitable and affordable child care at the local level. In the heart of Austin, tennis legend Andy Roddick is serving up more than just his skills on the court. He's helping local kids pursue their passions. I certainly remember all the mentors that I had at a Caswell Tennis Center and South Austin Tennis Center. Uh, back in the day, there was a place I could go. There was a place where my mom could drop me off and not have to worry uh, 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 about me being safe or me, you know, getting into risky behaviors or doing anything like that. It was this sense of community, which is um, something we've tried to create on, uh, on a better level. Established in 2000, the Andy Roddick Foundation focuses on enriching the lives of underserved youth through after school activities and educational summer camps during the months and times of day. Kids are statistically most at risk of falling behind. And yet we're focusing on math and STEM and creative writing and reading. We're making sure that we're actually building them up during the summer versus having a summer learning loss at all for our kids. With a one to six certified teacher to student ratio and a network of over 40 partnering organizations in the Austin area, the foundation fosters a sense of mentorship and belonging. And there's so much research that shows that childcare provides higher participation in school, higher engagement, higher, you know, better grades, higher graduation rates, but also on the social end, we're building friendships, they have stronger peer relations, they have self-control, they have self-confidence, and that's what we want for all of our kids. Child care costs exceed $13,000 annually in Travis County, accounting for some of the highest figures in the state of Texas. The Andy Roddick Foundation is advocating for changes in policy that directly affect the families they serve. And what we do on a micro level, uh, that messaging and, and what we uh, kind of the lessons learned, I think, can can uh, commute to to kind of macro policy level. So uh, we'll always push for that. Um, hopefully we can be an example of uh, of what's possible. With cost and access being two of the biggest barriers, Travis County leaders are taking note. There's been a recent step forward in expanding affordable child care. We had a win. Uh, May the 14th, we had a unanimous vote uh, across the commissioner's court to continue this conversation for ballot language uh, for a July 30th vote. And we're really excited because we need to do something different. We need to make sure that our kids have the best outcomes. We need to make sure that we have a greater workforce participation, that we have family stability and can make sure that we're doing more for the economy. The foundation is just one of the organizations in favor of tax election to increase affordable child care options for low income families. If approved, it would equate to around $10 more per month for the average homeowner and generate about 75 million to provide early childhood and after school care. We always kind of report uh, to the data. Where can we have the biggest impact? How can we um, not not deal s purely in just feelings, but actual data that suggests that what we're doing will have the most impact uh, on their on their lives uh, later on as well. With 45,000 kids served across the Austin area and counting, the Andy Roddick Foundation hopes to continue providing meaningful educational experiences, sparking creativity and encouraging leadership opportunities for generations to come. We've had uh, former kids who were here and then come back as counselors teaching lacrosse because they were exposed to it first in our programs. And that just, uh, that, uh, you know, that'll make your heart sing. And that's kind of the, the, the goal. Children attending Thomas G. Harris, Bernice Hart, or Pecan Springs Elementary Schools are eligible to enroll. For more information or to get involved with the organization, you can visit their website, andyronickfoundation.org. We'll be right back after this.